Bonjour. Haircut day today. Beard trim, looking good for the All England show tomorrow. So this is gonna be a very, 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 very quick video. Couple of minutes at most, maybe five, 10. You know what my promises are like. So uh, most of you know I run the, or did, I say did, um, I lent it to a friend. So I had the Trident Upflow filter in my Nexus 320. And I run that up to the start of summer and absolutely pristine results. I know a lot of you have run the Trident and are happy doing so, but what I did is I lent it to a friend. Um, he was having issues um, just around the corner um, and it's done wonders for him. But uh, now I haven't got the heart to ask for it back. Um, so what I had to do as an interim, and the reason why I took it out of the pond start was because um, I was having to go away for work quite a bit. So the cleansing of the filter, cleaning of the filter every two or three days, um, it just wasn't a possibility. I couldn't ask the family to cover that for me. Bless them. Let's put this down here, my arm's aching. You're now sat on top of the barbecue. So, um, yeah, so what I've done, I had to come up with an ingenious idea to keep me going through the summer. Um, I'm back at home as normal now working, so it's not a problem. Actually, what I've discovered is this is a really good in the middle solution, if you like. Um, so a lot of people ask me with the Trident, obviously it's a fantastic bit of kit. And if you can afford one, definitely do so. Um, I will leave the link in the comments. I think Neil's still selling them on uh, eBay. But I had to come up with something as an interim solution. A lot of people said to me, God, you know, I've just bought my Nexus. I don't want to be spending another 200 plus quid. Um, and then a lot of people, like myself, um, I was very fortunate at the time. I had birthday money to buy it. Um, but had I hadn't, it's not something I would have been able to um, budget for. So a lot of people have said, you know, is, is there another solution? Is there something cheaper I can do? And I saw lots of people trying different things and with various degrees of success, but I've been running something over the summer. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna give the Nexus a clean because I haven't cleaned it in over a week. My bad, um, been a bit lazy, but thankfully because of the rain and that I haven't been feeding as much. And I say because of the rain, it's because I didn't want to get wet and come outside because I'm a bit of a fair weather ponder. Um, but yeah, what I'll do is I'll give the Nexus a clean down. I'll take the easy section out. That's my dog, other dog run past as usual. Um, what I'll do is I'll get the easy out and uh, I'll show you what I've done as an interim solution. And I'll give you a quick sneak peek of the, um, the water quality in the daytime. I've got plenty of videos at night, but not many in the daytime. Like I said, because it's been raining. I don't like rain. I don't like coming outside in rain. I'll see you in a minute, all right? All right, that's that on for a boil. Don't leave your Nexus all week without cleaning it. It's not good and it will 100% contribute to that horrible yellow tinge in the water. But alas, can't be told. So in terms of my water quality off the Nexus, you see the yellow tinge, that's my own fault. But coir on the bottom, I'll give him some food in a minute. Uh, so they're nearly one and a half down. Grumps is a bit higher up. They're coming up for food now, but yeah. Water wise, excuse the bubbles, that's where I have my two air running. In terms of clarity, I'd say the tinge is my fault. A, I don't think I've got a big enough UV, and B, I've been lazy, I ain't cleaned the filter. Yeah, so, it's not bad. I've never got, um, I mean, it is fine free if you like, and I could never get that with, I mean, like this week I haven't been feeding, but normally I feed quite high, sort of five, six times a day. I've never been able to get it this clear with just the Nexus. But there's happy in there. You can see there's no fines in the water. Happy, happy, happy. But yeah, so that's on for a boil. I'm going to have a cup of tea. Those are the koi, they don't drink tea, but I will give them their breakfast. See you in a bit. Right, here we go. So, I've just finished cleaning the old girl. It was chocker block. It absolutely humdinged. It's always surprising the overflow pipe, how much you have to clean that to get it to, from a hummer dinging. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to take the whole thing apart. I'm just going to oik my easy chamber out and uh, rest it on top carelessly and you can have a quick loop. All right, so that's the easy section out. So all summer, 
So water wise, we're looking like that. What's contributed to that is this. So this is my easy section, just got it out. I'm gonna do, it's quite handy actually, give me a chance to do a back flush quickly. Excuse all these horrible buggy things, the larvae. They're a nightmare, but as they make their way to the pond, they are free food. Yeah, so that's out. So all I've got here is duct tape. So not any old ordinary duct tape. This is the expensive all weather waterproof duct tape. And as I say, I've been running this for um, several months now. And so far, so I'll show you the biggest concern, obviously. So what I'd done was I actually, I was lucky because I had the trident. So I was able to do this while the trident was in the um, filter. Again, excuse these, that's not dirt. It's them funny little buggy things. So you'll see inside, you'd expect the crap to build up, but it doesn't. Um, so what I've done then, so obviously if you go with a trident, it's the full, you're going to have to get the full Shavam. You know, that is your Rolls Royce. Um, but this is a happy go between middle of the road so what I've done is I've taped up half of the easy with the external grate just helps with the vortex of the water and what I'm finding is it's pushing the ship further down and a lot quicker um, so far I've had no issues with boiling with this it's not made a blind bit of difference cleaning hasn't been um, any harder and as I say this week um, we haven't fed a lot but normally last week I let it go as well I normally clean the filter twice a week but last week I only did it once um, water dropped slightly but not disastrous um, but as well as the tape so there we've got four rows of the duct tape the waterproof duct tape and that's just stopping the top grate from clogging up as you can see inside but then inside what I have is so obviously with the easy the center pipe is grated all the way down, if I put it in there, to this point, so about halfway down the pipe. What I've done, and I could go one further if I wanted to, but actually I'm pretty happy with it, um, and I do hope that one day I'm gonna get my trident back. Um, but what I've done is I've actually taped off the first set of grates. So I've left one and a half, so one full set of grates and a half set of grates. If you've got a, uh, an easy and you're looking at it, you'll know what that means. Um, and then I've just, that means I've capped off a whole length of grates before the solid bit of stainless steel. But honestly, that's, as I say, that's been like that for most of the summer. I've had no issues, I've had no bacterial issues. I don't, I mean, this crazy stuff, this duct tape, so you think, you expected that to start peeling away by now, wouldn't you? But honestly, I can't even pick that away with my finger. Um, I've seen no issues from leaching of chemicals as I say it's the waterproof um, and I've tested this I've done the stupidity so you don't have to um, like I say I've had no issues whatsoever but that is it so duct tape in the middle duct tape on the outside but remember not normal duct tape it's the expensive duct tape it's not the 4 dollars a roll it's a 7 dollars a roll just in case you're wondering what that looks like I'll put a picture here and I'll also put a link down in the description probably be screw fix or tool station or some other brand but yeah so 7 dollars jobs are good and doesn't make any difference to the cleaning regime but makes a massive difference to the water yeah. Enjoy, have fun. Catch you soon.